Hey guys, welcome to another episode in the playthrough of Mankind Divided. We have a new loading screen recap of where we are, so let's read it. Whispers from the shadows. En route to TF 29's offices, Jensen received an urgent call from Vega. The bug he placed in the NSN's motherboard had uncovered signs of a conspiracy. I was like, he, Vega is a she. But indeed, it is Jensen who actually placed the bug on her request. Uh, Vega played the recording to Jensen when they met inside an abandoned Lynn clinic. It sounded as if Miller had received orders to frame Ark for multiple attacks, including a break-in at the pharmaceutical giant Versalife. Jensen told Vega to investigate the break-in while he met his boss at TF29's private helipad. Apparently, Miller wanted Jensen to fly to Gollum City to arrest, arrest Ark's terrorist leader. Right, there we go. We are in Golem City. And I read, I think, unless I'm confusing, but I've read good things about the, the whole design of this place. That it's really like a cool cyberpunk-esque uh, place. And I'm just curious, one second. Did I... Because it didn't start full screen. I hope it is still on exclusive full screen. Yes, it is. Uh, that should all be good. All right, we have to get to a house. Miller claims the augmented rights coalition arc planned both the attack in Prague and the ambush in Dubai. But the recording Alex played for me suggests arc is being set up. Only their leader, Dr. Talos Rooker, can tell us the truth, provided I can bring him in for, quest for questioning. Objective details. Go to Sokol's apartments. Miller made a deal with Tibor Sokol, one of Ark's newest members, to help get inside their territory. Sokol is waiting for me in a residential section of the Utilec complex at housing unit 237. So we need to go to housing unit 237. And let's clear these items. Right. I urge you to refrain. More violence will only escalate the situation. It will only serve to strengthen their justification. We must be strong. I know it is hard to ask. How long ago was my last hit? I speak to all of you, not as the leader of Ark, but as your neighbor, your friend. Our only source may be the language. So tell me. Alright, I cannot listen to him with everybody. Uh, ah, his broadcast ended anyways. Anyway, she... Um, it sounded pretty reasonable. I think he said, uh, put down your arms. I don't think Ark and him are behind terrorist attacks. No shelter, no food, no fucking hope. Not so long. I'll make sure you get the first one. The last time, the last time, the last time. Just block it down. Left? Just passing through. Someone, someone, not again. I fucking can't feel my toes, man. Class 3. Really weird. It looks like lead and text. Who oh, that sticker? Latin is not really spoken anywhere. Oh man, I need a hit. Fuck. He's not that I'm aware of.
Right, Leana to Oscar. I'm sorry, my dear Oscar, of course I forgive you. I wish I could be there to hold you and help you. Please hold on, there's always hope. Love, mom. Reference mail, Oscar to Leana. Hi, mom. I know it's been a while. I wound up in Gollum City. I know you warned me not to get augmented. I know you said I was wasting and destroying what God gave me, and maybe you were right. I don't know. It's horrible here. Ark has some aid workers. They give us neuropocene when they can, but it's never enough. And the pain is so bad, I turn to neon. It was good at first, but now I can't stop. I don't know how much longer I can hold out. I just feel like giving up. I'm so sorry. Is there any chance you can forgive me for all the things I said and did? Oscar. Wait. Um, what did his mom say? Of course I forgive you. I wish I could be there to hold you and help you. Please hold on, there's always hope. Right, that's a nice reply. Mother. They are all having these breeders, and I guess that is neuropozine. To help fight off the augmentation rejection. Look, we are understaffed, underfunded and underprepared for the sheer number of people here. Wonder, are these flat textures? No, they look to be like 3D. Just block it out. Maybe it's like some kind of a parallax occlusion mapping or something, or uh, whatever that's called. There's also another term for it, I forgot. But trying to make 2D objects appear 3D. Our Right, we have a couple of drones. You must submit to an identification scan. Initiate security scan. Welcome to Golem City, Clank. Man, why do you need to be so dismissive? Rabaya, Brown New World. In a recent interview, Nathaniel Brown described Rabaya as a haven for Oaks, further revealing that the self sufficient city in the desert is costing over $7 million per day to build. Santos' CEO seemed unperturbed. It's not just the money that keeps me doing what I do, a honeyed brown opine to camera. Rabaya is giving augmented people all over the world an opportunity to rebuild their lives and dignity. It's a win win scenario for everyone and I'm proud to be involved. Inspiring, isn't it? In other news, Brown will attempt to walk on Santal branded water before turning it into wine and toasting his investors. Uh, the idea of Brown being held as some kind of business saint is repugnant. Reports out of Verbaya paint a picture of indentured oak workers ransomed to 
pittance, salaries, with promises of a place in paradise. Trouble is, the only people getting tickets are those willing to buy them with Santo's money. The projected capacity of Santo land, sorry, Rabaya is 101,500. There are 7.1 million augmented survivors since the tragic incident. By my reckoning, that's roughly one for every daily dollar spent. Building a paradise most can't afford. Will Brown make them pay to dig their own graves next? Dentures. One second. I think that means being in debt. But just want to double check. Bind by an indenture as an apprentice or laborer. A legal contract that reflects or covers a debt or purchase obligation. Anywho, Taiyong Medical, a chip of the old block. Worry not, dear Ox, for the chip the UN demands you swallow or be damned. Apparently, unobtrusively supports intrinsic nervous control of installed augmentation. What's more, you will now be considered safe against involuntary aberrations in expected behavior. Excellent. This alarmingly dystopian lingo is borrowed directly from documentation written by Taiyong Medical, the chips manufacturer. The tech giant is no stranger to this kind of controversy either. Wasn't it Tim that supplied the quick fix biochip to repair malfunctioning augmentations back in 2027, only days before the incident occurred? Uh, now. Barely a year later, here's another, sorry, quick fix chip from the very same experts. No, aberration in expected behavior from Tim either. No aberrations in expected behavior from Tim either. Right, another laptop. Uh, Martin on Chema. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Nice. Alright. Dr. Martin Otsiema to administer re or Berg stolen aid shipments. Minister Berg, I understand that contacting you directly is a little unorthodox, unorthodox, but the situation here is getting out of hand. I can now say in no uncertain terms that the PCR have been stealing our aid shipments. I spoke with Dr. Logan last night and he mentioned that he found over 100 charcoal water filters dumped into a sewage drain near the police block. Water filters I was expecting in the last shipment. As you can guess, they are completely useless to us now. As a result of our shipment being stolen, I've reached out to the Augmented Rights Coalition for help. Dallas Rucker has assured me that if the organization could send any additional aid to you to the UTLEC, he and his people will ensure that the shipments are secured and delivered to us. <laughs> In the meantime, ARC has been kind enough to supply us with fresh vegetables from their greenhouses. Please, Administrator Berg, I understand that this request is stretching the organization's resources, but these people are dying. I look forward to hearing from you, hopeful Dr. Martin and Siena. You are receiving this automatic notification because I'm out of office. Thank you for your patience, Rehor Berg. Uh, Uh, another mail from the same person to the same person. A 
Administrator Burke. I understand that contacting you directly is a little unorthodox, but the situation here is getting out of hand. While the organization strives to provide aid to as many people around the world as For a long time now, the PCR have been seizing our aid shipments. In desperation, I have reached out to the Augmented Rights Coalition for help. Dallas Worker has assured me that if the organization could send any additional aid to you, Lackey and his people will ensure that the shipments are secured and delivered to us. In the meantime, Ark has been kind enough to spy with fresh vegetables from the greenhouses. It is exactly more or less the same, not exactly, but 90% the same email as earlier. Please, Administrator Burke, I understand that this request is stretching the organization's resources, but these people are dying. I look forward to hearing back from you. Ever helpful, Dr. Martin Otsiema. Dr. Otsiema, firstly, I'm sorry to hear of the trouble in the UCLA complex. While the organization strives to provide aid to as many people around the world as possible, we cannot put focus on one area over another. Yes, the situation in the UCLA complex is dire. Yes, the people there deserve our attention, but so do so many others around the world. I won't bore you with the numbers, Dr. Otsiema, but doubling our oil efforts in UCLA Gillette would be to the detriment of one of her other programs. I'm sorry, but you and Dr. Logan will have to rely on what you have available to get you through until the next scheduled shipment arrives, currently 43 days hence. Now, on the subject of seeking, subject of seeking assistance from the Augmented Rights Coalition, I must say, Dr. Onsiema, I'm very disappointed to hear this. We cannot work with nor consider assistance from any group that is associated with terrorism, proven or not. If word of this gets out to our donors, I hate to imagine what would happen to our funding. Please dissociate from Thales Rucker and the Augmented Rights Coalition immediately. Everything being said, I do hope you are keeping well, respectively, re or uh, Relocation at Sento Corp to Dr. Martin Mchema. Greetings, Dr. Mchema. We hope that you find your new housing unit inside the Utilex complex to your liking. Please refer to the registered resident guides before sending any questions you may have. As a security measure, your safe is currently assigned to temporary code 9990. You can reset this code to your own reference before securing any items inside. Thank you and have a pleasant day to Santo Group Relocation Services. Man, a lot of background noise. Really annoying to read when you have like television, radio, everything in the background. Eliza Kassan on repeat is also getting a little bit annoying to be honest. I can't keep living like this. Anyways, uh, yeah, I, I like the aesthetics of this area, but there's way too much dialogue going on all through each other, if you ask me. Right, I cannot open it. I'm not sure how this works. Alright, let's just at the feet of all augmented. Not simply on. Get back to where we were. Deserve that. I am the majority, brutalizing an unarmed majority. 
That sounds familiar. Don't let them tear us apart. We are stronger together. Penguin. Let's not just empty out and steal everything from like somebody who's already having a hard life in this ghetto. Swats. Gurus. This is a level five. Let's save for that one. Right. We have only one objective. But man, this is a hard one. If you consider how many level five locks there are here up here all right i'm gonna use stealth maybe holy shit one two three four five six one two three four five six one, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, that's the same. So this is five, four, 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 four. This is five, 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 two, four. Straight ahead is the easiest. All right, let's just go. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. this one and then that one anomaly detected trace program initiated and then I will nuke this one and then get that one and that one uh, probably using a stop worm. I will not make this. For me, 
maybe I will. Access denied. Ah, God damn it! That was so close. All right, let's try that again. Um. All right, stealth. Alright, I will nuke that one. Yeah, I need to nuke this one as well. God damn it, I cannot nuke it. Alright, I will just nuke it a bit more. I could also stealth my way through that one, maybe. Alright, here we go. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Alright, come on. Yes. And I will nuke this one. And then afterwards, we will make it. Come on! And I will new it. Access granted. Woo! Close one. Alright, from Viktor Marchenko to Ivan Berg. Hello brother, today's momentous day for our movement. Today is the day that you fulfill your pledge, not just to me brother, but to Ark and to all of our augmented brothers and sisters throughout the world. I am sorry that your time with us here was not long, but know that your memory will live on forever. Today you will become a legend. Back to the drawing board. S. Whitaker to Melissa Berg, Ivan Berg. Hi, you two. I'm sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but Ivan's license consultant application was deep sixed. I don't know by whom, but whoever they are, they're high enough in city politics that I was told to stop asking. So it looks like yet another avenue of getting you both out of Utrecht and back here where you belong has been unsuccessful. I wish this time had been different. I will keep trying for you. Lieutenant S. Whitaker, Tarvis Head of Operations, Prague. Melissa Berg to Ivan Berg. My love, I am writing this because I want you to have it with you always, no matter what happens. I want you to know that I am now and have always been proud of you. We cannot deny things have been very difficult for us lately, but I have never ever regretted my decision to accompany, accompany you to Gollum. You are my husband, I love you, I trust you and I believe in you. Yours forever, Melissa. All right, so that was a pretty High level hack for yeah zero relevant information. Right here we go. No shelter. No fucking hope. Whether we can go to the left over here. It should be possible. I don't like the cops being here any more than you do. What do you say? There was another Because there was like this. Um, They've got us caged up like animals. So why not go over there and tell them to go away? Uh, maybe it's over here. There was like, where did we come from? Was it over here? Here, to the left. Where the hell does 
this end up there? I promise. Do not give up hope. I can't see a losing fight like this. Despite our dedication, everybody is at our cost. Despite the fact that some of our own were killed in the attack at Right, this is a residential yeah, area. Yeah. I don't know, this is where we started, I think. Yes. Alright. So that looped back into itself. Alright, let's just go straight on. Because upstairs I pretty much explored it, right? Yeah, except for this whole way over there. It will only serve to strengthen justification. I know it is. Right, I will do a quick sweep again. going on over here oh shit ah <laughs> uh, uh, this is a radio thought it was pocket secretary for a second it's working for the map Over here. Ah, I can also go over here. But it's basically the dead end. over there and upstairs I'm pretty sure before you check it out yes that area we check out it's apartment if you can call it an apartment God damn it. Idiots. Ah. Microchip, let's just leave that be. Book. Whole side area really 
He didn't bring that much. What the hell? Ah, this is fire hazards. Some bullets over there. But again, I cannot be stealing from people who hardly have anything themselves. Hello, mister. It's an Escoche time. Yes, they are pretty badass. Not as the leader of the Cannot deny that. You will force us to use force! Trying to maybe look for indeed your opposite, please. A pocket secretary or anything. Or a bit of the background story. Watch yourself, Clank. Yet you're not right. This is not necessary. Before I screw it up, let's save the game. Oh, yeah, well, no. it's a <laughs> ah, 237, that's where we need to be. People are rounded up over here. Let's talk to our contact. You people. Now what? What other lies have you come to tell me? I'm sorry to bother you. But I'm here to see Soko. He's expecting me. Which one? My husband Dushan? Or his foolish brother Tibor? I guess it doesn't matter which one. The police took them both to the Narrows to torture them for information they do not have. It's been a rough day, especially here. I can see that. But maybe I can help. What happened? Like you care. My husband is gone. Tibor said he had a way of getting us out of Gollum City. A contact with... Wait. Who are you? I'm the contact. Then maybe there is a chance? There's always a chance. I'm sorry. Normally, they only take ARC members. Tibor is ARC. He has been taken before. But now, after the bombing, they come for Tibor. Dushan, he asks why, and then... They take my Dushan. He has done nothing. Nothing! Do you know where they were taken? I told you already. The Narrows! Instead of asking stupid questions, why don't you do something? Don't just stand there, they need help, please! God damn it. Alright, no, I want to um, succeed in that conversation. I wasn't aware that it was time driven. It's quite annoying. That you're immediately thrown into one of those cutscenes. Luckily, I had a save shortly before. You people, now what? What other lies have you come to tell me? I'm sorry to bother you, but I'm here to see Soko. He's expecting me. Which one? My husband Dushan or his foolish brother Tibor? I guess it doesn't matter which one. The police took them both to the Narrows to torture them for information they do not have. It's been a rough day, especially here. I can see that. But maybe I can help. What happened? Like you care. My husband is gone. Tibor said he had a way of getting us out of Gollum City. A contact with... Wait. Who are you? I'm the contact. And maybe there is a chance? There's always a chance. 
I'm sorry. Normally they only take Ark members. Tibor is Ark. He has been taken before. But now, after the bombing, they come for Tibor. Dushan, he asks why, and then... They take my Dushan. He has done nothing. Nothing. Do you know where they were taken? I told you already. The Narrows. Instead of asking stupid questions, why don't you do something? Hey, I can see you're upset. And you're right to be. But if you have information that can help me get you and your family out of here, please tell me. It's not too late. I'm sorry. It has been very difficult. Tibor has been arrested before. He thinks Ark will keep him safe. The last time he was rescued by someone coming in through the ceiling of his cell, there are many places in Golem City that are unfinished. Maybe that can help. I think it can. Thank you. Adela. Adam. Alright, um, so we have a little bit of a clue. Go to Sokol's apartment, we already did that, and now find Tibor in the Narrows. Turns out Sokol and his brother were swept up by state police in a district raid right before I got there. They're being held at a local police outpost in an area called the Narrows. Time to go find him. Alright, we will be doing that in the next episode, because hitting the 40 minute marker, um, so I have to end it here. I uh, hope you enjoyed, I hope to see you there, for the meantime, do not forget, always to keep on gaming, see you later.